Now, since I've been doing this YouTube shit, right? I've been feeling like, oh, I know how the game goes. I'm pretty seasoned. I know how to maintain entertainment value, how to have an audience. You know, I'm, I'm not tooting my own horn, but the streams do really well. And there's a lot of um, very generous people out there, like Young Polo and a bunch of other people in here that, you know, show love. Not to mention the amount of sponsors and stuff. So I, th I feel like, you know, even though there's a ways for me to go, I'm still pretty experienced. I know what's up with the streaming thing, right? But I did not know that there was a ceiling far higher than the one I've reached. 20,000 viewers ain't bad. It's good. But nigga, there's some dude who streamed the other day. LOL Tyler One, is that his name? I don't know who this nigga is. I never heard of this nigga before. But all I know is he came back to stream. He's not a company, like a big organization with a bunch of promoting tools or whatever. He's not some kind of group, a gamer group like FaZe Clan or something. It's one nigga. Some, some, some random dude who wears tank tops. He looks like a regular like a cool dude, chill dude, right? Nicholas, he came back, apparently he was banned from Twitch or whatever, came back to Twitch, stream. Nigga had almost 400,000 live viewers. Fucking shit. I have never seen numbers like that from an individual. Like I said, not a team, not a company, not a tournament. A nigga with 400,000 fucking props, man. Props! Never in my wildest dreams did I imagine it's possible to reach a viewer count of that magnitude as a one-man stream. I mean, granted, he was playing League of Legends, which is a very mainstream game, you know, so obviously it has far more appeal than, you know, our little niche Nintendo shit here. But still, to, it blew my mind that that was potentially possible. That a nigga could pull that many people together in one live stream. Consider that with 400,000 live viewers, he damn near had almost my entire whole subscriber base in one stream. Uh. That to me was like a revelation. The heights are so high. It's so much more, there's like, I thought the ceiling of streaming was like 60,000 live viewers at one time, 100,000 live viewers. And that's only possible by companies. But if one man can get 400K at once, then dog, the sky's the limit. You have no excuse, I have no excuse. There's always more room to grow, man. And whenever you think that you're at the top of your game, the top of the mountain, there's far more to go. I'm not trying to like lecture you or be a motivational speaker. I'm telling you this as a revelation for me. It blew my mind. I was like, God damn. And here I am thinking, okay, I'm one of the like, you know, I'm, I'm one of like the top 20 streamers on YouTube at least. That don't mean shit. And you know what? I love it. The fact that there's just so much potential out there. Man, don't let anybody tell you, motherfuckers, you can't motherfucking get a heads up on the stream game, bro. 400,000 live. That broke records. <laughs> it's crazy, man. But, yo, I, it took League of Legends, you know, it's League, so, you know. But, hey, listen, I think the most viewers I ever had in a stream was, like, 30-something thousand. I think I had, like, 32,000 at one point, and that was my max. Even guys like Ice Poseidon, who have had, like, crazier maxes. When he did UFCX, he had, like, 60,000 viewers. When I saw that, to me, it was like, this is the cap. I've never seen a one-man show go this crazy before with, like, that many viewers. And then this dude, Tyler, one came through, 400K, blowing it out the water. It was like, what? But goddamn, man. I, I, know some, I know most of you guys probably know about this Tyler, one guy. Considering the popularity of League of Legends... Yeah, it, you probably knew the information far before I did. I don't know who he is, but he pulled it off, man, and that shit is impressive. I, I mean, I don't watch League content, so I tried to watch his stuff, and I was like, uh, this just doesn't resonate with me. But you know what? Don't take away from his numbers, that's for sure. The nigga has it going on, man, and props for setting that ceiling so high. That bar is raised, my boy, and I am looking forward to, to, to seeing the potential of this live streaming thing. I want to get my hand deeper inside. I want to feel the eggs, nigga. I'm going to get in there. I'm going to grab me some eggs. <laughs> All right, boy?